you're alive. Arthur. No way, that's it. You're you're alive. <laughs> Arthur. You're okay. It is a miracle. It is a goddamn miracle. Yeah. Have, have something to drink. Have a drink. Somebody Here. give him a goddamn drink. Oh, son. Son, take it easy. Let's go. We got another group rounded up down the way. I don't get your drift, Mr. Uh... Levi Simon, senior overseer for Alberto Fusar. We run the third most productive sugar plantation. Oh! in the Northern Caribbean. Of course, where there's money to be made, there's trouble. What sort of trouble? No, oh, the usual sort. People wanting what ain't theirs, and others telling them to take it. I don't get you. Labor troubles. And other thieves and pirates looking to disrupt our ways of working. Well, how very upsetting for you. Not half as upsetting as it'll be for them. Mr. Fusar has a lot of very powerful friends. I will bet that he does. Bunch of Haitian pirates won't frighten him. He's strung up in the streets soon enough. And do we seem like Haitian pirates to you, Mr. Simon? You seem like someone or other. We was headed to Tahiti. You was going the scenic route. Just as soon as I know exactly who you are, you'll be free. In the meantime, you'll not starve. Cabo! Llévese a estos hombres a la carsa, junto con el grupo de cucarachas de ese campesino. Cualquier tontería que hagan, dispárales a todos. Welcome to Guama, gentlemen. Now, if you'll excuse me. Yeah! What now, Aiden? I don't know. What do you think? I think we've got to get out of here. Yeah, but they can't find out who we are. Well, for now, we're stuck, Ben. Well, for what it's worth, I think I would have preferred Tahiti. You and me both. <laughs> people who knows well they got them chained and lashed but they don't look too dangerous excuse me sir who are our new friends here <laughs> criminales what crime did they commit insurrection <laughs> insurrection that's quite a word Cállate, señor fuente Cuévate. todos
Everyone okay? Uh, yeah. Uh. Damn. Reinforcements. Oh, dear. We need to get out of here. Now we're in trouble. Come on, come on, Fabit. Everyone, follow me. Quick, Fabit. Come, come, come. Ah. Ah. Oh, yeah. oh, get out of here. Get out of here. There's a lot of them. Ah. What do you think? We gotta move, Dutch. Cool. Don't lose face, son. We'll find you. Cooey, cooey. Go, go. <laughs> Follow me. Quick! Hey. Hi. So, uh, what's the plan? Well, I found the cave Herr Cool spoke of, and also a guide. She's up ahead. I think we can trust her. Follow me. The entrance is along here. Just watch your footing. gonna get the hell out of here and set sail for the one place ain't nobody gonna be expecting us uh, uh, get everybody together uh, and get ourselves back on course where would that be place we just escaped from <laughs> you want to go back to sandini if it was you got left, you'd want us to go back. I'd want it, but I wouldn't expect That's it. That's the point. Ain't no one gonna expect it. We come back from the dead, gather everyone, and we leave before anyone realizes we've even resurrected. The insect bite you or something? Cause you gone, friend. We look like what we are. A bunch of desperado on the run. But with the women, a change of clothes? <laughs> We're a choir, or a gang of pilgrims, or something. Whatever you say. 
A bunch of penniless fugitives on some Caribbean dump. Sneaking through caves while two of our best men got shot back home. How could I doubt you, Dutch? You got no idea, Arthur. No idea at all. I will do whatever it takes for us to survive. I guess that's what I'm afraid of. Hold on. Why? Gloria! Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Dinero, the money, the gold. A key. Damelo. Oh, it's genuine, the old hag. Oh, vamos. Vamos. Rápido. Now that gold right there, that's the last bit of gold I have in my pocket from the bank. The rest of it is at the bottom of the sea. Exactly. <laughs> you know, wasn't Fusar one of the fellers Bronte pointed out to us at the party in San Denis? Yeah, you're right. I knew I'd heard that name before. So did you deal with those workers for Herr Cool yet? Not yet. I will. But you don't think he's just using us? Almost certainly, but we don't have a lot of choice. This is the best chance we have right now of getting out of this place. Won't be long before someone figures out who we are and sends word to the U.S. So what happened with John in that bank? He survived. Unlike dear Hosea and Lenny. The only one they took alive. Why is that, you think? I don't know. I was already on the roof. I didn't see it. And Abigail, I presume she was able to slip away in time. What are you talking about? You know, when I look back at all the chaos of the past few weeks, the apparent superficial chaos, I begin to wonder, maybe, for somebody, this is all going exactly to plan. I still ain't sure what you're saying, Dutch. Nor am I quite, but that many Pinkertons arriving like clockwork once again? The door is stopped. You will have to lift it. Pardon me, my queen. Arthur, come help me with this. Just lift it. Okay, then. <laughs> Almost there. This way. Then you pay more. Okay. More. Just a second. Pay more. Pay now. Dutch. Ah. What are you doing? Ah. Jesus. Ah. Easy, Dutch. What was that? Horrible old crone. But you killed her. She was going to betray us, Arthur. Couldn't you tell? No. Well, I got some Spanish. She was. You sure you're all right, Dutch? I am just trying to make sure that some of us survive, Arthur. Now, shall we proceed? I guess. Listen, <clears throat> son. You think I want any of this? I don't know. Of course I don't. But I made a pledge to you all. We would survive. No matter what. So how did you know she was going to betray us? What'd she say? It was in her eyes, in the way she was leading us. But you said you knew Spanish. I know human beings. Art. Well, maybe we've all just gone rotten. I'm doing the best I can. I come from Mexico. I never met those men. Does anyone believe him? Oh! He's 
Mr. Simon doesn't believe you. Even the mule doesn't believe you. Eso ni fue para tanto. Sí que deja de actuar. Sabemos que no estuvo tan fuerte. Fue bastante duro. No. La próxima vez será aún más duro. Bueno. Ha sido un placer. Siempre me encantaron los mexicanos. Listening to that fool, they won't notice us if we stay quiet. We need to deal with them. Well, I'm sure you got some ideas. Shut up and help me kill them. On my count, you take the one on the right, I'll take the left. Going there. Why? Well, you know me, Arthur. We'll cause ourselves a little distraction and then poof, we will disappear. Take the other side of this door. Tienes algo de tomar? ¿Cómo sabías? Porque te conozco. Sí. Escondí una botella. Voy a buscarla. Gracias. Okay. You take the nearest one on the left. I'll deal with his friend. Es una mierda. Es lo más bajo de una civilización. Now we need to create a diversion. Uh, what do you think? Find another old lady to strangle? That is enough, Arthur. This is a war. Well, if this is a war, then we need to start blowing some stuff up. <laughs> exactly. Is there any dynamite? Oh, no, we don't need dynamite. We got a furnace and lots of sugar. Sugar? Oh, yeah. <clears throat> no problem. You'll see. <clears throat> Go close the windows and the doors. Go on, quick. <clears throat> There is no cut. This place is built. For me, I'll get this going. We better hurry. Follow me. Okay. I don't want 
want to be too close to that building when it goes up. Come on, we can hide behind that well. That place has to blow soon. Get ready to make a run for Javier.
He's passed out. Or dead. Uh, he'll be fine. I'll get him out of here. You stay here. Take care of these fools a bit. No problem. Go, quick! Thing. <laughs> 